On the last five or so videos I made, I pretty much lined everything up. And if you read all the descriptions and all my videos I've ever made, you'll get the most out of it that way. Because I'm able to usually fit a lot more in the descriptions than I do in the actual video audio. Uh, but anyway, if you really, really, really want to know more details on how the whole fourth generation warfare, the whole hybrid war uh, situation would be inside the United States, I should say that you want to go back and look at a past four-part video series I made called um, Infiltration by Foreign Elements. That's the name of the videos. It's four different videos. Go read the descriptions. Uh, it's four months old, so scroll down my video list until you find them and go look at them. But uh, aside from the fact that Biden and uh, Putin are really not even talking to each other and are talking through surrogates, which is concerning in and of itself, like a guy named New York Prepper said, um, they, they are likely in a bunker somewhere or in deep communication with their general staffs, which is understandable, and I figured as much. But, um, yeah, I wanted to go into some other aspects that I think are going to contribute to the downfall. I know I've already mentioned some of these things ad nauseum, but along with what's going on right now, uh, I watched a guy's video by the name of uh, Logic Before Authority. He has, he has a pretty decent channel. I mean, he puts some good videos together. And I've said it before that I think the snake bite is like a genocide program. And it's going to wipe out a lot of people that took it that we, would have, that we would depend on in a situation where we were at war with somebody. Which is a big, big contributing factor to the fourth generation warfare uh because some of these politicians and corporate corporate uh entities pushing these things these corporations um i find it funny how the chinese communists the chai um they're on a lot of these boards for these corporations and they own and bought and paid for a lot of the politicians pushing that thing and I also find it funny how um, there's a lot of predictive programming in movies. Hmm, like I Am Legend comes to mind with the uh, 5 to the G uh, linking the nanotech that people take into a massive computer system and also able to rewire. It's an operating system. If it can rewire people's DNA, hmm. I wonder if it'll turn people into zombies a few months down the road. I mean, it's very possible. I mean, we don't know what it'll do, but that would sure make it easy for our overseas enemies, don't you think? And uh, along with the wastewater thing in Florida and a lot of other things going on, I mean, some of these things appear to be overt acts of sabotage. And of course, the mainstream media is never going to say that, but, you know, just things to watch. Uh, again, I'll let you all know if I see any other things in this Ukraine situation, so may Yeshua bless you all and keep you.